turn mob griefing on. Oh my god! Yo! Mr. Gast! Yeah. That body's a blessing, girl. I ain't trying to pressure her. She messed with the temperature. Hey guys, it's me, Bravo, and I'm back with another video. So, welcome back to another episode of Modder's Guide. Let's get an applause for Modder's Guide's comeback. Um, yeah, so in this episode, we're going to be doing mob specific quick mods. So, Oprize LP um, released a big update where he made like 30 different quick mods and uh, they're all pretty cool and in this episode I'm gonna be showing you the mob specific one so that means each different mob has their own specific quick mod which is actually pretty cool it's kind of like you know how console has like console exclusives well these are like mob exclusive quick mods and uh, yeah so let's go out of here because um, there's not enough space in here for the mobs that we're gonna be using today so uh, I put a creeper over here because um, you'll see. Uh, yeah, so we got a pig, a sheep, a wolf, a soaker, a ocelot, a parrot, a bunny, a villager. He's actually a, a nitwit, which is pretty cool. Over here, we're going to put an enderman and over here, we're going to put a ghast. So I saved that because they might like despawn or something. Um, mostly the enderman. And uh, yeah, I, I didn't put the ghast. Before I started the video, just in case that it wanted to like blow something up. So uh, let's actually, before we spawn them in, make sure mob griefing is off for now. And uh, yeah. Alright, so we're going to quickly spawn these guys in. And then we're going to exit and save. Exit and save. And I'll see you guys once we're on the computer. All right, all right. So we are now on the computer, and uh, we could go ahead and click on the Xbox 360, and click on our mod tutorials world. All right. So once we're gonna open that up, we can go ahead and click our player, right-click him, go to chunk, and most of the entities should pop up. So we got our villager, the Enderman, and the Ghast to go for first. So all of these quick mods, you pretty much have to right click every single mob. So just right click the villager and he has all of these specific quick mods. So uh, his specific quick mod is uh, the villager profession. So you could actually change if he want if you want him to be a priest, then let him be a priest. If you want him to be a farmer, then you could be then you could choose a farmer. So uh, we're going to go ahead we're going to go ahead and make him a priest because priests are cool. And uh, right click again and you're obviously able to do villager trades. But you guys already know how to do that. As well as custom names, add potion effects, and uh, entity property. So this is actually a new one uh, where you can actually make him invulnerable. So that means he's unkillable. Silent so he doesn't make noise. Uh, ignore gravity so that he can't fall. Uh, glowing doesn't do anything. No AI makes him so that he doesn't move. And uh, never despawn is always good. And uh, yeah, so we're going to keep that. And let's go ahead and do the Enderman. So we got the Enderman specific thing is actually you could choose what specific block he's carrying. So it could be any block in the game. So we can make him carry a block of gold and he'll be like a ball in Enderman. And uh, yeah. So let's give him one block of gold. All right. And also, I think you could also do the entity properties for every single mob. So that's pretty cool too. Um, and let's go ahead and do the gas. So what this one is, is gas explosion power. So explosion power is basically, um, I don't know how to explain. It's just how big the explosion is when it shoots at you. So that'll be fun to test, wouldn't it? Hopefully that doesn't crash your game at 10. And uh, let's go ahead and look for the other people. <laughs> all right, all right. We got most of the mobs over here. So, uh, oh no, wait, that's an armor stand. Actually, my armor stands for some reason stopped displaying the name. I have no idea why. Let's just see what exactly happened. Um, everything seems to be good. Update passengers less riding. I don't know what... I don't know, it's, it should be visible. 
I don't know. We'll we'll save. I'll save that for later. Uh, but yeah. All right. So let's get back to the video. So we're back and uh, we let's go um, mod the pig. So for pigs, you can actually make it so that he has a saddle or he doesn't have a saddle. So let's say um, you can't find a saddle in your world and you decide to cheat by modding and uh, you don't want to go to in creative. You can mod it in so that he has a saddle and boom, you're cool. And the sheep one is actually a really cool one because you can change the color of his wool. So if you want a really cool looking sheep, there's all of these colors to choose from. Let's go with cyan because you never see a cyan sheep ever. And you can, all, you can also make them seared or not, but who wants to have a seared sheep? Uh, try saying that five times fast. Seared sheep, seared sheep, seared sheep. That's really hard. All right, uh, wolf. So you can have a wolf display his collar and make the collar red. Any color. Let's make it light blue because light blue is a cool color. And uh, shulker. Shulker is also a really cool color because normally you're not going to find a colored shulker. But guess what? You can mod it so that he is a colored shulker that shoots fireballs at you. Well, not fireballs, but whatever they shoot at you. So uh, let's make him orange so it's kind of like a fireball. And ocelots. All right. So ocelots, you can just make... Uh, it, an ocelot that's a tuxedo cat a tabby cat a siamese cat and um, let's go with tuxedo cat because why not so basically it's not a tamed ocelot but it, it, it looks like a tamed one which is pretty cool uh parrot type you could also change what type of parrot it is uh so silver parrot look why not all right rabbit i think it's the same thing where you can change what type of rabbit it is Salt and pepper rabbit, brown rabbit, white, black, black and white, gold, salt and pepper, and killer bunny. Ooh, killer bunny. Ooh. I wonder if it actually turns it into a killer bunny. That will be cool. All right, let's go look for the last few mobs. All right, we got the creeper boys. So basically, you can make it so that the creeper does insane amounts of damage. You could also make him a powered creeper. You can make it so that the minute you spawn in the world, he explodes, but you don't want to do that uh the delay so how fast he explodes so make it so that let's say you walk up to him and he explodes instantly and uh radius so this is how big the explosion is going to be so we want it to be a radius of 15 blocks so that's a pretty big radius and uh yeah so it's also a powered creeper so it's going to be like more damage um and let's see I think the last guy we got is going to be the slime. So over here, I saved the best guy for last. I don't even think I showed you guys the slime in the back. You guys probably saw him, but I didn't really say his name. Because uh, this one's the coolest one. Basically, if I can find him. All right, found the slime. <laughs> Jeez, that took seven years to find the slime. All right, so we found the slime. And basically, you could actually change the size of the slime. And make him a gigantic slime. So let's change his size to 12. Hopefully that won't crash the game. It does give you a little warning down there that says large values may crash the game. So don't try to do a size 100 slime. Because that will never be good. And uh, yeah, so I think we got everything. Make sure to comment down below if you guys are experimenting with these quick mods. To let me know if I missed out on any mob. The only mob I think I missed was the magma cube. Yeah, the magma cube. But it's pretty much the same thing as a slime. So I don't have to include him. Sorry, magma cube. But uh, I don't think any other specific mob has like a cool uh, quick mod. So I think we're good for now. So we're going to go ahead and save. And uh, we'll see you when well i'll see you once we're back at the xbox 360 all right boys we're back uh, we're on the loading screen i'm gonna go load up the world so that you guys could see my first impression on the mods that we have made so hopefully you guys are enjoying this series so far again okay so uh that slime is humongous and he definitely escaped the arena <laughs> didn't we put him in here he just bounced oh my gosh he is so- wait, I need to get a screenshot of this. Oh, okay, he doesn't want to look at me. He doesn't even want to look at me. Oh my gosh. Guys, 
Wait, let me, let me, I need to, I need to get a good screenshot of this. Uh, okay, he doesn't want to look at me, I guess. Oh, uh, I see, I see how it is. Bye, slime. <laughs> Alright, so he bounced, and let's see if anything else worked. So, as you guys can see, our pig now has a saddle on it. We could go ahead and ride him, get stuck in the glass. That's all cool. Uh, we got cyan sheep. Is that even cyan? That's pretty cool. I, I guess they changed the colors or something. I never noticed. Um, we forgot to tame the wolf, so his collar is not going to be there. But as you guys can see, this guy is orange, and he's alive. Like Usually, you can only have uh, the soaker chests, and those can be colored. But this time, you could actually have a soaker mob, and he's colored. So that's pretretty cool. And once again, we did not tame the ocelot. Therefore, it didn't work. And uh, this actually got this guy turned into a silver parrot, which is cool. That guy's a killer bunny, and it says entity killer bunny dot name. I don't know why. I, I guess that's what you have to name it in order for him to turn into killer bunny. This guy is a priest. And um, where did our gas go? Where um, gas, Mr. Gast. Alright, we're gonna back out and then come back in just to show you guys. Alright, we got Mr. Gast over here. And we got uh, charged, Mr. Charged Creeper over there. Um, so what we're gonna do is... We're gonna light this creeper and see if he can kill Mr. Gast. Oh my god. I forgot to turn mob griefing off. Alright, take three, take three. <laughs> um, whoa, that guy jumps so fast, guys. Alright, so we're gonna hopefully hope that they don't despawn. Mob griefing is off. I mean on. And uh let's get a lighter hurry up before one of the mobs despawn. Okay then. And our our gas despawned. Yo! That explosion was so big that it destroyed my building. Yo, okay, so that that's an extremely big explosion. And uh, our Endy man is over here. He's chilling with his golden block, and uh, we're gonna exit and uh, exit without saving again, just so that we could see the gas do its work. All right, boys, our guy's set free. Hopefully, he comes after us. Come on, guy, Mr. Gas, I'm right here, looking all tasty. Can I fly? Oh snap, Mr. Gas, do you not want to? Okay. All right, he, he's attracted to us. Let's turn mob griefing on. Oh my god! Yo, Mr. Gast! He literally destroyed the place. It is flaming. Uh, Mr. Gast, I didn't know that you were this angry. I'm sorry, I should have walked your dog. I'm s Okay, uh, so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Um, let me know what you guys want to me want me to cover in the next episode. Uh, Mr. Gast is just chilling up there. And uh, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.